warm welcome to this video video so in this video we're going to look at on uh, how to get the data source ODBC to the control panel in Windows 7 uh, first of all we check uh, check it on by going to control panel and uh, here it goes to the system and security and um, click on administrative tool and here I check out a data source ODBC in my case the ODB data source ODBC driver is existed but if I go to click this one and um, if I wanted to create a MSX database and uh, if I click on add button and it shows only SQL server and SQL server native client there's a few um, drivers are available right now so I want a MD, um, dot MDB to access the driver so what I have to do is I need to get the ODBC data source over here for that I was the easy trick here just uh, go to C drive and uh, open windows and uh, there's one file called uh, sysvo64 click on it odbc ad32 this is the odbc32 you just copy this one and uh, go to the control panel and uh, system and security that administrative tool and just paste it over here now open this one I will get the MSX database click on add you will get um, a set of drivers you want to set up in data source so click on um, Microsoft access driver now so finish so I just named this uh, data source as a video and go to select and navigate your uh, data as MSX table for example if I have um, yes in application 17 there is application DB ACES DB so select this and uh, click on OK and OK now you have created a data source called video over here and click on OK. So this is what exactly uh, needed for this uh, Windows 7 basic if you are using and uh, yes, suppose uh, if your ODBC driver is not installed correctly you can uh, use this trick. I hope you understood this particular tutorial. That's it about this. Uh, thank you for watching with your video.